I think one of the best ways to learn um, any piece of knowledge is to teach it. How I became inspired to be a teacher, I wanted to learn more about it. And the more I learned about it, the more I did yoga as a lifestyle, I think it just kind of naturally flowered into wanting to teach and share this with others. I really wanted to heal and work with people, but I did not want to give people shots at, like a nurse or something. All the information was different than I expected. There was more about the spirit of the food that was being talked. And it's, that's something that we're not taught in medical school. You just can't help but go out and share this in whatever way suits your life and your path and your journey. Just touching other people and sharing with other people things that have changed me and changed my life. It forces you to, first of all, understand better, and secondly, you embody what you're teaching. So you become an example of um, the knowledge you're giving out. To have the chance to not only practice it, to enliven my own life, but to share that knowledge with other people is just like a dream come true. As much as the philosophical concept, it is very practical and it's tools that you can apply every single day. I was kind of being shown my purpose in life. So that's what led me to the Chopra Center to start to learn more of the uh, uh, vocabulary and other things that I could then put out to people. From the moment that I taught my first student, my life was never the same. I knew that practicing Ayurveda really would be an, an enriching experience for myself, but I didn't realize that I would be able to teach it until I found this framework until I found that the Chopra Center had been doing this work to bring together the ancient wisdom with the scientific discoveries. I inherently like to teach. So when I became uh, uh, knowledgeable about the wisdom traditions, Ayurveda and, and uh, primordial sound meditation, I thought I should teach and then later teach others to become teachers as well. These days I see many teachers are amazingly evolved. Having gone through the three teachings and being at Vedic Master, I have just found such a deep appreciation for the knowledge and the wealth and the depth. And it really solidified all of my teachings together. It has been very beneficial for me to stay in the passion that I was brought to so long ago and now to really see it come to fruition has been truly wonderful for me and my students and I learn as much from them as they do from me. They have really wonderful knowledge and they have ingested it and metabolized it. What I've learned here is that healing really starts from inside. All the medicines, all the cutting, it's all for the effect and not the cause. And, and the healing should be from the inside. The, the pathology or the problem that the patient comes in with Obviously, it varies person to person. Everybody's a little different. I've been able to give at least a basis for relaxation. With their help, I think we can reach a critical mass to create a more peaceful, just, sustainable, and healthy world. You know, through the seminars that I did with the Chopra Center and books I read by David Simon and Deepak Chopra, they really profoundly changed my own life. And I went from somebody having a great career but being totally stressed and overwhelmed to someone who knows how to find, well, my own dynamic balance in every moment of my life. And that's what I want to share with people. It's a practice. So it's not a perfection, but it's really a practice that anyone can do at any stage in their life. And it's one of the most beautiful gifts that we have. And I'm so excited to be able to share that as a teacher here at the Chopra Center. I realize that these tools can at least bring an opportunity to men or women to go inside, find a place of where they can forgive and be and just have a better opportunity. If they have something that roots them in one thing a day. It'll change your life. It'll change your patients' lives and you'll help everybody else start healing their proper way. It is a better system and a better, more healthy way of living than any I've ever encountered. And it really feels like the right thing to do.